This is Dapu7. Some updates here to this very interesting interstellar object that they've dubbed Atlas. They say that it's a comet making its way in, and they admit the trajectory of it is rather peculiar and suspicious. We have some scientist right at the gate saying that it's not natural. I've reported on these things. They've even gone as far as to say that it could be an alien probe or harness some kind of technology and that it could be coming to either save us or destroy us. Well, now they're saying that it's got an unusual brightness, suggesting that this is not a common thing. And they go on now to say that the diameter is of 12 miles. Okay, in the initial reports, they were saying seven. It's now 12. Now they're saying that on July 21st, the Hubble telescope caught a glowing area at the front, something that's never before been observed in a comet. That is their exact words. They're saying, what is it? Why is it glowing like this in the front like a headlight or something? Why is it dropping down into our plane on a trajectory that would, there's a 0.2% chance that it's natural? Now, I'm going off the data, guys. I'm not trying to go off a of hype, conspiracy, or anything. We want the facts. We want the truth. We know some of the objects that's come through here before have been super suspect. But they put the name on a muamua that meant, that meant scout. And then when you looked at a muamua, long, cylindrical, metallic in nature, picked up speed when it left off out of here, those are all facts. It's not conspiracy. These are facts. So we've got this massive interstellar object, the, the largest ever on record, moving the fastest they've ever seen anything move on record. Now... This, what they want to call a comet, is coming in, glowing in the front. And they're saying that a comet doesn't glow in the front. That's their exact words here. Uh, and we've seen comets, the whole thing glows like uniformly uh, and has a long tail. And when it gets closer to the sun, it can even have two tails, an ionized tail, okay? We've tracked these and seen these over and over when they're comets. This thing, as you can see in the left image, in the center image, displays no tail. They're asking what and how. And some of the scientists are saying just that. Like, well, if this is a comet, as they say, where's the tail? And they're pointing at these images, all this data, and saying there is no tail. Instead, it's got an odd glow on the front of it that a comet shouldn't have, that you can see in the right image. So, odd details, indeed, coming out about this thing. They're saying that it's just not a natural thing. They keep hinting at this and making these statements. Um, it's not natural. It's on a very finely tuned trajectory. Is what one scientist here says. And uh, when it comes into close approach, we're not going to be able to see it because it's it's going to come right in past all the major planets, just perfect to observe everything, and then hide behind the sun when it get, gets to its closest point. Although they say it's not being affected by the sun because it's moving at such a fast speed. Timing and all this very interesting. Regardless, this is an interesting one, guys. Going to keep tabs on this. I'll update as I get more information. Join me for the live streams going live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern, right here on Dabu 77. I'll leave links below. Eyes to the skies.